I really don't like that entrance. Hello everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Oh, intro. It's not interesting, it's got it. But I, I mean I can change it, but like what do you say and not sound like you're honestly authentic. But welcome, we have this sultry, cute ass look going on for you. So today I am collaborating or doing this sponsorship PR video for Berry's Lashes. Those are the lashes I currently have on now. What like you know ginger mean in this video was just having or knowing so many young people because I feel like I know so many young people that are up to amazing things and I just like to give a few businesses shout outs. You don't even have to know them to be inspired, just the fact that people your age and even younger or like people around your age frame are like doing amazing stuff to give you the enough ginger that ah oh, I don't have to be on the TL all day. So I'm gonna be shouting out um Traplanta, the whole of Traplanta group. <laughs> they have merchandise and you guys should check out their new EP or mixtape. I'm not sure what it is because I'm and I'm gonna be shouting out Shade of Grey as one of my best friends. <laughs> Love you, Shannon. Shout out to Shannon. Me. And lastly, and my favorite is the Revealers or the Revelers Revealers. I think it's Revealers because it's like I'm opening your eyes. It's, and thank you guys for being you and doing what you're doing. <laughs> I'm really sorry for my absence this past few weeks. It's not been my calling or my fault, and I'm gonna keep trying to bring out content as consistent as consistently. Do you know that English is hard? Yeah, I want you guys to enjoy this video so much. I love you guys. And you okay, let's get some makeup done. I start off with some facial oil to moisturize my face, and I go ahead to spray my face, you know, for hydrating, have my skin looking like shut down. I'm going to be using some bar soap today to lay my eyebrows. When applying my foundation, I put orange corrector on the dark spots on my face. Went ahead to highlight and contour my face off camera. I'll show a full view of that later on. Filling in my eyebrows now, I'm just trying to go along the gradient of my actual eyebrows and do a very, you know, light soft job. And I went ahead to clean it off off camera as well, and I show you a full version of that as well. Since this is a matte look, I'm going to be using a pretty substantial amount of powder today. So I'm just pressing it into my face before I start to bake. Going over with a lighter shade of powder for my under eyes to make it snatched. Starting with the transition shade for my eyeshadow because it helps me feel more comfortable when I'm doing it. I left the top part of my eyeshadow to smoke out my bottom lash area to help me find or the angle that I want it to extend. Using the same brown, I go back to my main eyeshadow and just smoke it all up together and give it a nice blend. Blend and blend and blend and blend. Everything is about blending. blending. Just up to sip some juice. I'm going to pack a brown a bit lighter than the shade I used to blend out my face. As you can see, some eyeshadow is already falling in the trap of my setting powder. That's the job, that's the work that we do. I'm going to attempt to blind myself by putting this white eyeliner in my waterline, pushing my eyes down with a powder filled brush to help it easier to reach my waterline. I use bonding glue to fix my lashes. Since I started using it, I've been having no problem. I would advise you to use it too, but be very careful because it is still bonding glue. Powder highlight on the face today, you know, look at that, shiny, look at that, dusted up face, look at that, amazing stuff, get this. After applying my lipstick, I wanted a bit of a browner feel to it, so I added some eyeshadow to, you know, brown it up. Yeah, 
please subscribe please like this video leave comments whatever you want to comment on and tell your friends to tell their friends to come through because there's a party and it's happening here <laughs>